Bauer and you are watching Dirty Dog Live Music TV and we are here at Sprague Farm and Brew Works in Venango, PA with the band Midnight Drive from the Hermitage area in Pennsylvania and I would like to introduce Jeff from Mars. I'm from Mars, uh, I play bass. And um, yeah, I'd like you to introduce the rest of the band, please. Okay, we have uh, Jim Scott here. Jim is also from Hermitage, PA. Uh, we have Ron Bonkowski on rhythm guitar, and Ron is from Stowe, Ohio. He's our uh, Ohio boy. Representing. <laughs> we have uh, Tom Carpenter from Hermitage, PA, and he's not the uh, he's the brother of Jim Scott. No, <laughs> just Jim actually lives in my basement. <laughs> He wasn't invited, he just shows up. Yeah. And we have Scott Pearson from Warren, Ohio. He's, Hi, our, he's our man on fiddle. Fantastic. See, in Dirty Dog Live Music TV, bands, they all come from everywhere. He's actually you know? from Warren, Pennsylvania. Did I say Warren, Warren Ohio? I said Warren, Ohio. I love Warren, Ohio, but <laughs> Warren, PA is nice, too. They come from everywhere, but this is an award-winning bluegrass band. We selected them especially for this show tonight, especially for our Sprague Farm and Brew Work. And um, can you talk about some of the awards that you've won? I know there's multi-award winning going on here. And... My awards would be teaching awards. Ah, teaching. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I, I know Jim, Jim does banjo contests. Uh, we, all, we all have experience playing in a, in a lot of other bands. And uh, this is, this is our, all of our latest project and something we have a lot of hope for. Uh, I'll let the guys talk about some of the things Scott that they've done. Here. Award-winning fiddle and mandolin player, guitar. Go ahead and tell him. He's won what, Walnut Valley, Merle Fest. I won a Merle, Merle Fest of perpetual second place at, at the Winfield, Kansas. But we, that's, but we that's don't so let him exciting. play mandolin in the band. We make him play fiddle. I see, because we have a mandolin player. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I love fiddle. I love fiddle. I love yeah. banjo, bass, all of this. You know, I think he's won mandolin contest. Right. You know, and fiddle. The contest I've won, but hot dog eating contest, pie <laughs> contest. So. I won a hairdressing contest a long time ago, but yeah. back when I was a hairdresser. Yeah, so I understand that. You know, it's it's achievement. It's about an achievement and about trying and getting out there and trying to do the things that we do do. You know, um, you guys are very popular. You play all around the area. Um, give me some ideas of some of the things that you do. You do festivals and. Um, Festivals we do. We just got done recording a project in Nashville at Randy Core Studio at Slack Key Studios in Nashville. How exciting! And uh, we're getting some national airplay out of that, and uh, we're coming out with some new promo material. And we're going to be traveling to the Bluegrass Festival circuit here this year. Great! So yeah. Look for us. yeah, we're um, doing. Uh, we'll be doing arts festivals, festivals all around, uh, and we're really excited. We're up. I think we're up around 20 radio stations that are playing our music, and we're uh, we're hoping that just continues to broaden. What's so. the uh, what's the song that they're giving the most airplay on? Will you be doing that? It's kind of nice with some of the ones that Jeff wrote. You know, Jeff. Uh, it's funny. The first project we recorded, Midnight Drive, is uh, it's uh, we tell people when you listen to the CD, the first half of the CD is kind of depressing. It's about breakups and divorces. And then we sing a gospel song. And then we leave you with a happy note. But a lot of material yeah. that Jeff has wrote. <laughs> some of the material that Jim wrote on the song as well. And some of our covers. So. Yeah, I heard uh, crossing the double line on into the blue the Sunday morning program about a month ago. That's a national syndicated bluegrass track. Great. Wow, that's great. Gosh, we really wish you the best of success. And I'm really excited to have you guys on our show. Um, you guys ready to go do it? Let's do it. Let's play. Okay, let's let's play. Let's. We pick better than we talk. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> All right, this first song we're going to play is a song that I wrote, and uh, I'm going to dedicate it to my dad. He was, a, <laughs> he was a tough dad. My mom complimented me too much, and my dad never did. He would just kick me and say, get back up again anytime I failed. And so I dedicate this song to him. And it's been really nice. We've had uh, about four people come up to us and say that this song helped get them out of a depression or a funk. So hope it's something for you. It's called Get Back Up. Oh, dear. Growing up, teenage girls are so rough. 
give up women for the rest of my life. Daddy gives me some advice. Gotta get back up, shake it off. Sometimes life gets tough. Roll the dice, try your luck. It's my time to say You gotta get back up Shake it off Sometimes life gets tough Roll the dice Try your luck Hold your head high Get back up Shake it off Sometimes life gets tough Roll the dice Try your luck Hold your head high As you can see, Jim is no longer playing the banjo. He's uh, switched over to the dobro, also called the resonator guitar. And he's, a, he's an amazing musician. He plays guitar and, and banjo very well. And now he's learning this thing. And he put it on a song that he wrote. It's a sad song, and it's about as slow as we get. It's called I Can't Stand Tall. One, two, three.
house of pain Our memories on the wall I drink till I see The bottom of the bottle Without you in my arms I can't stand Without you in my arms, I can't stand tall. Yeah. <laughs> All right, folks. Are you, are you good over there, Jim? I'm good. Okay, because you know, it is a yeah, banjo. Okay. <laughs> they often say perfect pitch on a banjo is when you toss it into a dumpster and it hits a accordion. <laughs> <laughs> now we tell banjo jokes because, you know, Jim's, he's young at heart and uh, he learned to play the banjo on a dare, is that correct? Yeah. Somebody dared him to play the banjo and well, we think the world's a better place because of it. You know? That was two weeks ago. <laughs> two weeks ago, absolutely. Anyway, though, you know, a lot of the songs that we write have meanings behind them, and uh, this next song is courtesy of uh, Jim's ex-girlfriend. Folks, let's get that clear. Girls out there, he is available. Check him out on Facebook. Okay. <laughs> but this song comes courtesy of his ex-girlfriend's mother. Uh, they were on our way to one of our shows, and they were running a little behind, and uh, she was speeding, and... Uh, the officer behind her, I guess, thought she crossed over the double line once or twice too many and thought she was under the uh, influence of either drugs or alcohol. So she got pulled over and we got the song out of it. So we appreciate it. So uh, this one's entitled Crossing the Double Line. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. <laughs> Uh, this next song, like I said uh, before, that uh, it's another original tune that's off our new album. Um, it comes courtesy of Jeff uh, Shaler, our bass player back here. Like I said, a lot of the songs we write have uh, meanings to them, and this comes kind of courtesy of uh, Jeff's ex-wife. Thank you. Know, you. Yeah, they've never <laughs> if they never would have got divorced, I guess Jeff probably wouldn't have wrote this song. <laughs> but anyway, though, it's a title cut off our album. Uh, it's entitled Midnight Drive. One, two, three, four. Girls vanish forever, fails. Why do you have to leave me feel betrayed? You try to justify with your co-eyes. Why wonder, darling, did you even try? Love is honoring you. 
It's not what Mama did today. Hateful crimes. Little did I know I was hired as part time. Your cold, cold choices made me pay. So I'm leaving for a long place called away. Love dishonoring me. That's how my dark wild dream. personally believe everybody's got a little hillbilly in them. I know this bluegrass sure brings out the hillbilly in me. I love it. I hope you guys did too. Okay, tell me, how can people get in touch with you? Website. How can they find you? www.midnightdrivebluegrass.com More on the website than you'll ever want to know about us. You can buy the CDs <laughs> off of there. We got jams, jellies, and blankets, you know, <laughs> t-shirts. Uh, go out and see us on the website. There's a lot of information out there. The schedule changes daily. Um, you know, just look for us coming to a neighborhood near you. Fantastic. I'm really excited. Thank you very, very much for coming. Oh, it was great we'll to be here. Definitely see you out there again. I'll be listening on the, uh, the radio stations as well. Absolutely. Great. Now, Appreciate a lot of them have live feeds. You know, you can, uh, you can find That's a lot better live. than the dead feed ones, you know. So. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you very much for joining us. Look for us again, and we'll see you out there. Yeah.